Let me show you guys what we're building today. Oh no. My top down camera died. Okay, so this is what we built yesterday. We built this moon tower. So we're gonna be building this. So Bear Cables, one of my affiliates, let me is letting me build this. I'll show you guys the back. It's really pretty. Look at that. It has this like nice gold plate on it. It has the low USB. Hi Vin. Yeah, so this is I'm gonna say it wrong, but it's the Noi. Is that correct? But really nice board that Bear's letting me build. As you can see, it's winky lists right here. Nue. Okay, the Nue. <laughs> Nue. Nue? Nue? So I don't remember what's in here right now. It's 8008 Plateless. Okay, so this was by Studio Kestra. It's a 65 or 60%. And this version is when keyless, but it did come with Winky. It has gasket mounting tabs. Apparently it's on the PCB itself and not on like the plate and case. So this one is plateless, but the name means is French for naked. <laughs> so whenever we take this out, uh, I will show you guys what it means by the gaskets on the pcb but i guess it says on here that it's called nudist because it's meant to be plateless so this board came in two colors so this is the i think the rose gold and then there was like a blue yeah i think what's interesting is what is this called where the case goes over it's not like it's not quite sandwich so there so there's a gap right here you can see but it's like the top case goes over the bottom case like this and then there's this gold it's not it's kind of like accent weight like this gold one so this is what we're going to be building nk cream c3 stabs here are the gaskets for the pcb pcb so there was a plate that came in with it but we're not going to be using that. We have a foam right here. So with this cutout, it looks like daughter board. I'm really lucky that I have people that will just give me build to build. Like, I've somehow tricked people into sending me builds for free content. Such suckers. Right, so you know like PCB, it's normally like square. But this one's unique because it has these tabs which is where the gaskets. I think typically I see gaskets on the case or on the plate. I, it's, I think it's normally case, at least the ones that I've built. Yeah, so the name new is French for nude and it's designed to be a plateless build, right? Which is why you have it on the PCB. However, they do include an aluminum plate in case you're not ready to go full playlist. So JTS cable, daughter board, no LEDs. Did I try this build in it? I did, yeah. I was typing on it before I started. I'm gonna, I'm actually gonna do a typing test with this build and then with this new build. So I'm gonna swap it out. And so my typing test is gonna be a little longer so people can hear like the different builds. One hour, 48 minutes. Oh my God. Do you guys also take two hours to do your stabilizers? It's just me. Oh, so the reason why I do one one of these and then I press it is because there's a plateless build. And so I'm just making sure that these switches are fully seated. So the best way to do that, in my opinion, is to do one side, get it nice and secure, heat up the one that you just put solder on, push it all the way through, let that dry, and so then, or yeah, and then you know the other side is going to be ready to go. So you don't have to worry about making sure that side's seated. Oh, interesting. Okay, so look at this. Did they have different pieces for this? Or is this always... Was, it, was this just one color? But you can see it has these cutouts that go in the case. 
and then underneath it, it hides four more screws. It keeps the case together. So that's like one way to hide your screws. Pretty cool. Oh, okay. <laughs> I saw this. And I, I like freaked out. I was like, oh shit, what did I do? No, Bear, Bear did message me. Uh, it is uh, polyfill to stay flexy and not sound hollow rather than using the like the foam that it comes with. The gaskets are, Bear put them on the case instead. You can see gasket and then the gaskets are right here inside. So this is the designer or his company name, not sure, but this is where Bear got it from. And then here you can see the keyboard name. Also, have I shown you guys my slippers? I haven't posted on social media because like, I don't want to show my feet for free. That's my endgame keyboard. I don't have one. Endgame keyboard is just a myth. All right, you guys ready for the typing test? So this is the new. It is a plateless build with NK creams that were lubed by bear cables. Um, the stabilizers are C3 that are lubed with 205G and BDZ on the wires. Um, this is GMK, Noel, we got a Toki, and we got a Ditto. <laughs> um, but anyways, let's do our tiny test. So this is my first like full plateless build and it feels a little strange, honestly. <laughs> I mean it's not like it's not like the bad strange, but I will try it with the bare fur and with the what is this? Foam it came with. And we'll see if that like if it makes like a big difference. I do want to clarify that. Um Hollow is not necessarily bad. Some people like that sound, but me personally, I want it to sound a little different. So we'll see if we adding these will help it. It might also be because it is like a plateless build. But my overall thoughts about this board is, uh, it's a really pretty board. I think going for the pink was the right call. And the back, uh, yeah, the colors are amazing. The typing angle is not very high. I don't know the exact number, but it feels like a very natural typing angle, at least for me. So we're, we're going to add this bare fur. We'll see if it changes it. So this is the, the new typing test after we put in the polyfill.
Yeah, I I think it sounds better with the polyfill. And so I'm guessing when you add this that came in with the case, it just made it sound like way too muted. Because uh, the polyfill that we added in, uh, it wasn't a lot. Like it was a very thin layer as like you guys see. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.